about map. And map is a really important function. It's also very general, so you can even see it in different languages, apart from just um, uh, Racket itself. And map, pretty much what it does is similar to what its name suggests, it maps one value to another. So that might not actually not be obvious, but I wouldn't suggest they can be like a hash map. It's a little bit different. So let's take, for example, a. Um, let's say I want to add one to an array. So I have a array of nums. Let's make it really random. Okay. And I want to change all my nums and make it uh, plus one. So let's define what I call plus one. And it accepts an array of nums. So what I want to do is I want to map each value in the num. And just like I did with the filter, but this time I accept. Um, also one parameter. Oh, my bad. And let me add one no parameter x num. So this should compile. Don't say anything bad. Okay. And I will explain this in a little bit. So plus one nums. And it works. So map. You uh, plug in a lambda with one parameter, followed by the list. So it's not that different. It's actually not that different at all. Yeah, we could actually accept uh, throw in two parameters. So let's have another lump and num x and say pretend these are coordinates. We could actually um assuming they're the same length, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay. We could actually throw in two parameters in here, which is pretty neat. So I don't think many people are familiar with this concept, but we could actually uh, throw in two parameters for our. Uh, oops, that was messed up. So num x num y. And we switch over our lambda function now to actually accept two parameters and we simply add the two values. So it's pretty neat. So how about let's combine what we learned with filter from before. So we have this array produced by this value. Let's actually filter out all of the uh, odd values. So we're going to throw in a filter lambda x. And inside here, we're going to say uh, 0, uh, 0 remainder, x, 2, this is our lambda function, and this is our uh, other function, so let's do that. Yeah. Let's see if this works, probably missing a bracket. Okay, so here we have all the even results from all of these functions. So yeah. So this is my tutorial on uh, how to do map. So you're pretty much mapping values from one to another. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And uh, next up, I'll be going over Folar, which is quite a bit more difficult. And just to add another one to our list, we're also going to be looking at build 2D list. Um, build uh, no, no, build list, build list, build list. Build 2D list is something you can build using build list. So, and Folar. Um, yeah, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And stay tuned for the next one where I'll be covering folder.